Books certainly haven't been left behind in the digital age. With the emergence of ebooks, volumes upon volumes of written content can be stored and viewed electronically. With the debut of personal reading devices like the Amazon Kindle, you can easily store and access your entire personal library in the palm of your hand. If you want to read your ebooks on the go on any device, you might want to convert them to a file type like PDF. Here's what you need to do. If you just need to convert a few ebooks, you can easily do that using ebook2pdf.com. Just click on the link in the description below to get to the site. From here, just click on Upload Files, then find and select the ebooks you want to convert. The service will convert your books to PDF files on the spot. You can download them one by one as they finish converting by clicking on Download under the file name, or you can wait for all of your files to finish converting, then download them all at once by clicking on Download All. Files downloaded individually save themselves to your downloads folder, while clicking on Download All will download a zip file containing all of your converted books. If you have an extensive ebook library or need to convert more than 50 megabytes worth of ebooks at once, you can try Calibre, an open source digital library software available for multiple platforms. Just click on the second link in the description below to download and install the software. Once it's installed, you can add in your ebook files by clicking on Add Books. You can convert them by selecting all of your ebooks you want to convert, then clicking on Convert Books. To convert all of your files to a PDF format, just click on the drop down menu under Output in the top right and select PDF. If you know what you're doing, feel free to look through the other settings. Otherwise, when you're set, just click OK. Your converted files will be found in the Calibre Library folder. To check where that is, just click on Calibre Library from the app's main screen. You'll find each file in a folder labeled after each author. If these methods don't work, do remember that some ebooks are protected by DRM to combat digital privacy and thus cannot be converted or copied. If you like this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering ebooks, PDFs, and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.